had only started in 1942. But due to the impressive performance of the Tiger tanks during the Kursk battle, Soviet officials decided to push their new tank into general production much earlier than initially planned. Just one year later, the first IS tanks were rolling off the production line. Various versions of the tank were tried and tested until eventually the IS-2 emerged. By 1944, the IS-2 was in general production and had become a staple ingredient in the Red Army's arsenal. It worked well to symbolize Russia's evolution in the tank development process and served as a fitting statement of strength against the dying Nazi dream. Well armoured, mounting an enormous gun, it was extremely reliable and spearheaded the victorious Soviet push towards Berlin. The IS-2 was one of the most powerful tanks to emerge during the Second World War. It had a four-man crew. The IS-2's enlarged turret housed a 122mm gun, the largest gun ever to be mounted on a tank during World War II. Its armour was up to 160mm thick. Using the tried and tested V2 engine, the IS-2 had a range of 150 kilometers and it could hit a top speed of 37 kilometers per hour. 